morning, we got you covered. Chicago Tribune movie critic Michael Phillips. He's here to chat about all the winners and the moments of the evening. Hello. How you doing, Felicia? Uh, last night, I'm sure it was a pretty big deal for you in your house. Was yeah, well, I was, I was down at the paper. Well, you know, you work it while you're watching it. So I'm writing as it goes. And we oh, had wow. four hours long, but a pretty good show, I thought. <laughs> four hours is a long time. Yeah. So on Friday, we got to go through this. We gave our predictions of a winner. So I'll yeah. go first. Yeah, let's hear with, it. Uh, what I was saying, I thought Get Out was going to be best picture. Margot Robbie for uh, best actress in a leading role when she played I, Tanya. Um, and it played in I, Tanya. And then Daniel Kaluuya for best actor in a leading role. These are my predictions. Not exactly right, <laughs> but some of them did win. <laughs> some of them did win. That's right. Uh, and I picked uh, three billboards outside Ebbing, Missouri. Frances McDormand for Best Actress and Gary Oldman for Best Actor. Two out of three for me. Okay, I was going to say yours were Two a little bit three. more accurate. 33.333333% yeah. <laughs> <laughs> more accurate. Right. Okay, so let's go through the winner. Shape of Water ended up winning for Best Picture in uh, actor, I mean, excuse me, director Gilmer Del Toro. So best director, right. was this what you were expecting? Uh, this was a tougher Best Picture call to make in advance than I've seen in years. It really was. The acting, all the acting awards were pretty predictable, I thought. Or, you know, a a lot of people were betting on Oldman, Francis McDormand, Sam Rockwell yeah. for three billboards, and Allison Janney for Itania. They all won. Shape of Water, you know, it, it won the PGA, the Producers Guild Award, and the Directors Guild Award, and we should have known it was going to win based on those mm. wins. But man, I, I thought it was going to go three billboards. A lot of people were predicting Get Out, which okay. I would have preferred myself. Yeah. I would have preferred that. But yeah, I think, you know, there's two ways to look at the Shape of Water win it's the second fantasy ever to win an Oscar. The only other one, oh, wow. the full-blown fantasy that ever won was The Lord of the Rings Return of the King, the third Lord of the Rings movie. So this is kind oh, of wow. an unusual piece of little, you know, Oscar lore right there. The other way to look at it is that it is the fourth win for a Mexican-born director in five years. Oh, wow. Yeah, I mean, Alfonso Cuaron won for Gravity, and uh, Alejandro Inaradu won for both Birdman and The Revenant. So this is like a, this is like a Mexican wave, which was also yeah. continued with the win for Coco for Best Animated Film. Oh, there so, you yeah, go. Big night okay. for Mexico. Big yeah, night. I know you were telling me that you took the kids to see Coco. So if anyone hasn't seen it, they like have to do it. Oh yeah, it's good. For yeah, sure. That was a good win. Coco for sure. was a good I, win. And ju I just want to say about Shape of Water, I know that won for uh, Best Picture, but I've heard mixed reviews about it, which is why I'm not excited to go see it. But now that it's won, I feel like I need uh, to go see it. You should see it. And it's a, it's a screwy combination of about seven different kinds of movies, and it is not, you're right, it is not for yeah. everybody. My, my, uh, my in-laws, in fact, were traumatized by it uh, and will never go to the movies again. So I, I'm a little, you know, it's not for everybody, and it was not for Steve and June Keebler. Okay, so, you know. so let's skin through some of these. So best oh. actress, we know Frances McDormand yep. for uh, Three Billboards Outside Ebbing, Missouri, and Gary Oldman for Darkest Hour, and then Jordan Peele wins for Best Original Screenplay. That so get was out, a good win. A that was a good win, and it was a, a, with the Chicago angle because Jordan Peele came up a little bit through the Chicago uh, improv scene here, and uh, in addition to working everywhere else. And you know, I, as I say, I would have I would have been perfectly happy if Jordan Peele had made it a, a two or even three p kind of night as a director of Get Out and also for Best Picture. But we had to make do for Best Original Screenplay, I believe. Uh, that's a great win. And you could just feel it in the room. You know, the okay. response to Jordan Peele winning for that film, which was a very big deal a year ago, and, you know, really sustained its interest all year. Yeah, that was, that was That meant a lot. That meant a lot. And I think it points to a good direction forward because, you know, if they can, if they can, if the Oscars can open the door wide enough to get more get outs, maybe a mud bound or two. Yeah. You know, uh, so, uh, I'll you know say. which which got which got overlooked, I think, too much. Yeah. You know, this that's year. true. That's yep. true. All right. Well, we can check out your column today. Yes. There we go. He's been working all night. All this night. Hard working man. <laughs> Read Michael's reviews of all the films at Chicago Tribune.com.